A large-scale counter-offensive of Ukraine may begin. A large-scale counter-offensive may begin after the Ukrainian military enters the enemy's second line of defense. Ukrainian military and political observer Alexander Kovalenko said this. He stressed that everything does not depend only on the supply of weapons because tanks and missiles will not solve all problems. How can a tank help us get through a minefield if we don't have the proper engineering? Or how can we get through the same minefield if a missile destroys a fuel tank and lubricants behind it? The experts said that after passing through the maximum mined security zone by the Russians, the Ukrainian military would enter the enemy's main second line of defense. There will be another problem. In addition to mines and trenches, there will be a large number of artillery, armored fighting vehicles, tanks and other equipment. It is logical that we will start using the main strike groups in the second line of defense. It is there that more large-scale incidents can occur. At present, Russia wants to complete its occupation of the oblasts of Luhansk, Donetsk, Zaporizhia and Kherson. Ukraine seeks to liberate all occupied territories, including Crimea. Ukrainians insist that they have yet to commit the bulk of their fresher, better equipped and more mobile forces for counter-offensive.